Hey guys, it's been a while since I posted a video. I'm sure you're wondering about the shop build and all of that, but here it is, the kind of third of September, and the shop build is going to happen late in September. That's the soonest that they can get out. But I'm bringing you this video today because I went to the junkyard today uh, and found a little bit of junkyard gold. That's what I'm going to call it, some junkyard gold. I got really lucky in the junkyard today. I went to the junkyard because it's becoming rare that they get Mazdas at the junkyard. And I was looking online and I saw they had two online. So I thought, well, let me go up there and see what they look like. Um, and I was also looking for something else. And lo and behold, when I'm looking at these trucks, I found a little bit of junkyard gold. So anyways, let's get right to it. Here's the footage. At the junkyard today, and pretty much found a, what looks like a brand new aftermarket head, and the cam is in there, and it's hardly touched. I mean, I don't know if you can tell, but there's like new oil in there, and the cam and everything is just looking flawless. So, of course, I'm gonna get it. The entire head. Okay, got that cylinder head off and put the valve cover on it. Kind of hoping to get out of here without them charging me separate for the valve cover. Uh, looks like someone had been in here before. Like I said, the head looked really new. And so you can see right here where it looks like they were trying to clean the surface of the block and it got away from them and it jacked up that cylinder. But I don't know, the head looked barely touched, barely used couple hundred miles max maybe 200 miles max and here it is in the junkyard I don't know why but took that off I already got one or two of those I'm not gonna get that and spend the extra money actually I think they're kind of expensive here in the junkyard everything in the junkyard has kind of gone up in price just like those Honda Accord motors those things are like forty dollars and some change and environmental fees and crap and you can get them for thirty nine brand new on eBay hadn't done that yet but I would gamble on the brand new anyway Mazda Mitch was here Pow -pow. all right I got it anyway so I started off just thinking I'm gonna get that valve cover why not they're like 26 bucks at the junkyard and uh, when I took the valve cover off the head looked way too good to pass up. Heads are almost $350, $400 with no accessories. That's just the head, sometimes with the cam. So <clears throat> I took the head off, got, they, they charged me for some stuff. They charged me for cam gear and they call it the timing gear. I got out of there, the head was like 83 bucks. The valve cover was 20, well the head was 95. They charge a core. So it was 95. Then the valve cover was 26. They charge a $6 core. The timing gear was 12. And the thermostat housing was 7. And they even charged me for the damn thermostat in there that I'm not going to use. It was like $2.33. Well, they try to get you everywhere they can. I'm surprised they didn't charge me for the head bolts. I'm surprised they didn't charge me for the oil cap on the valve cover. There was one spark plug in it. I'm surprised they didn't charge me for that. But anyway, it looks pretty good. Let's head home, put it on the bench, and we'll look at it. Made it back to the shop anyway. So let's look at something. So I got this head, and I did a little cleaning up. And I noticed when I was at the junkyard that it had three plugs missing, but it had one. And here it is. No, that's not it. Yeah, it is. And it was really kind of beat up around the edges. So I was like, why is it like that? Well, on this head, which it's from, I kind of looked it up, C-I-F-I-C-S-T, and I looked it up, and I think it's a place out of California that makes heads, and um, they might do fairly good, but they didn't really do good right here on the, uh, let's dim this light a little bit, on the uh, spark plug area. You know how they have like little areas kind of cut out for the socket? Well, I just deburred it a little bit because really it's not enough. 
um, even in the back back here, you can kind of see I did a little Dremel tool action. It's not very good, but it was kind of crazy. And the same thing is applying for here. You can kind of get the socket on, but it wants to push the socket. It's on there, but it kind of wants to push it. And when you're turning it, it gets a little weird. So there's a little bit, just a little bit too much meat right there. It's just too close for comfort. Really needs a little bit ground out so that it'll work better. All the threads are good. It's just the, uh, it's not enough, it's the wall's too thick for a, for a basic socket. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to get some better Dremel tool stuff and um, work on that. Other than that, it's a good head. I'm gonna take this valve cover off, which, I mean, that's the really reason reason I, I was gonna get the valve cover. And when I took the valve cover off, I was like, wow, dude. Wow, look at this. I mean, this thing is barely used. Maybe a month old, the oil. Wow. The oil's not even dirty. Oh man, I feel like, wow. It's like they drove it to the junkyard and left it. So for $95, I'm pretty happy with having that. It's a good looking little head. I mean, like, I don't know if I can show you, but I mean, there's just barely any wear on the cam. Anyway, it's a good head. Good find. Look at that, where the, uh, where the fuel pump road, I mean, it's barely any warrant wear to it. Let's see if I'm zooming in on that. I mean, it's, it's in good shape. Anyway, it's hard to record. You get the idea. I got a good head at the junkyard. So, yeah, they charged me for this. What they call a timing gear, cam gear. Um, got that, and they charged me for a thermostat and the thermostat housing. But hey, you know what? I got that little little thermostat plug. I got a front plate for free, basically. So I flipped it up on the back end, let some of that oil drain out of it, and uh, you know, it's just it's barely used. I mean, it's got probably good you know good valves I mean I don't know if they've been lapped and stuff but so you see let's see here if I can get on camera this right here that's a that's a uh, an indicator to tell you when you have faced it enough like when you get down to this that's as low as if you was to deck the head that indicator and down here let's see here that indicator that is as little low as you can go when you deck it that's the limit so it's not down to that so it's like it's a pure cast head not some redecked head if that makes sense okay so some other things of course I got were of course an, an emblem uh, some of those spark plug things that go on your valve cover I need some of these in my truck with the black roof on the back where the speakers used to be um, also man this was a great find this is a very mint brand new air conditioned switch perfectly brand new well brand new to me this was in the truck and it was like brand new had to get that for free yep a couple of little things it's a good day today.